find cos 1500. To find this, we should follow this method C. Here we have 1500. Now we should check. 1500 lies between which two multiples of 180? What I mean is, 1500 lies between 1440 and 1620. This is 180 into 8 and this is 180 into 9. Between these two numbers, 1500 lies. Next, 1500 is close to which number? This is close to 1440. So in place of this, now we should write 1440 plus 60. So this will become cos. In place of this, now we write this. 1440 plus 60. This is your step 1. Next. Cos. Now in place of this, we should write 8 into 180 plus 60. Next, here we have 180. So cos is not going to change, it will remain cos. And inside, we get this angle 60. Now the question is, will we get here plus or minus? To answer that, we should look at the number before 180, that is 8. And 8 is even. And all the even multiples of 180, they lie in either in the first or in the fourth quadrant. So now to select the quadrant, we should look at this symbol. Here we have plus. That means angle lies in the first quadrant and in the first quadrant cos is positive. So we should put plus. So plus cos 60 is 1 by 2. This is our answer.